I have given orders to the generals to marshal an army. I don't think you understand the importance. Your Majesty, I understand that everything you ask of me is important. When did we last need an army? They are coming. You have time, sir. Very little of it. There may be more to this than she's telling. Murder and torture are not enough for you? This is all we've ever done. You are one word short of the wrong end of her whip now. Murder. Family. Do we go back, sir? New orders? I take no sides. We move to a higher task now. Only the side of peace. We need more. Or what? You burnt my farm? Things here are not always what they seem. Perhaps you can tell me why these priests don't send their fighters as a mob to put an end to this woman on the hill. We agreed you would not come here. It jumped at me like a rabid beast from the wreckage of that place. Take another. No one will listen to reason. And you, as principal of this nation, you cannot see everything that transpires. The army will march. I have spoken to the general. They will set out two mornings hence. We cannot work rebellion. Should we not try other remedies, short of arms and killing? What power this is, I cannot tell, but I will uncover it. Soldiers will march. This is not the principle I speak for now. This is for us. Will the presence of an army raise greater fear than that which drives them to savagery? All ties are broken now, sweet things. I must leave you to your fate as I have been left to mine. <laughs>